Hello, Hello people. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. We are back. We are back. Finally. It's, I know I just said Happy New Year, it's but we're kind of already, is what is it, like mid-Jan already? But it's what our first it? video and it is so exciting because Sarah is back. I'm back. Back in the house. Back in the game. I'm driving so I'm not going to actually look too much at the camera. Sorry about this terrible lighting but we thought it would be nice for you to see us on the go. Normally actually I'm the one driving because A, I get really bad travel sick and also B, just, don't know, we've always done that. <laughs> routine. But routine. But my son decided to be sick all over his car seat yesterday. So my car's out of order. What I want to ask you, Sarah, because yeah. a lot of people asked this to me when I first came back to work after Alfie, was how do you juggle the mum guilt? How did you feel like this morning when you were getting ready? Yeah. So I think a lot of people would be interested in knowing like, where is Lenny today? <laughs> She's already forgotten about him. Never. Um, and how do you feel? First day okay. back. It feels really good to be back. I had four months off, which I loved, and it was amazing to kind of spend time with him and be mum. But when I got ready this morning and I was getting myself together, like it did feel really good and really nice to be back and to kind of find a balance between between everything. So. My mum, my gorgeous mum has Linny, and my mum's mum, um, which is really cute. Oh, it's your grandma there yeah, as well. my grandma's car. That's so cute. Uh, I think what I said to you before is that it's important for you to us to have that feeling of, um, by the way, if you just saw my <laughs> sick band, oh, like, yeah. <laughs> it's because I get really sick. bad travel thing. <laughs> Um, yeah, I think it's healthy to have a mix and yeah. to, f to walk out the door and feel like the old you and yeah. And I feel like look, when look, it's a first day. It does feel a bit weird, but I feel good at the same time. I've got all my clothes in the boot and it's, it's fun. Shoes, like this is fun. fun. And you know what? I did feel like a part of me, a big part of me, was missing. I think when you have your own business, I'm sure you'll agree. When you're on maternity leave, when you have your own business and you kind of put your blood, sweat, and tears into it, just to suddenly cut off from everything, like it does feel weird when you're doing As something. All especially day, every day. when this little human takes over your life, yeah. and you lose, you do lose a bit of you, in the best possible yeah. way. And you probably also, I found, I gained a lot in me that I didn't even know yeah, it's was different. existing. It's, so a it's totally different. different life. I don't think. I never knew what it was going to be like. I never knew kind of what my days would be like. Like I never understood kind of how long it took to get ready in the morning. Yeah. You know, tonging my hair, no chance. Yeah. Um, but no, it feels really good to be You're back. I'm mighty fresh. Oh, thanks. Not when she's seen me recently. Uh, and I'm really excited to be back. And it's a gorgeous sunny winter's day. It's We're our favorite really type of day. I love a cold, crisp day with the yeah, sun shining. The weather is really nice. So We're waiting for the photographer. Yeah, we've just got here. We're waiting for our photographer who will be here very soon. Yeah. And so, and yeah, we thought we'd do a little, little little vlog on our first shoot yeah, back and of also, 2019 a lot of people ask us like how it works how we plan outfits where we shoot how we shoot so we just thought a nice one us back together showing you exactly how everything works yeah so we usually shoot about four or five outfits and that is our content for the, the week weekend. ahead um so we planned it we met each other over the christmas break yeah and we had a little brainstorm kind of looking at trends thinking about yeah. what we've bought recently and on the Instagram for Insta, um, inspiration, inspiration. and so we came up with our my arm is really oh. aching um came up with our four or five trends which are really excited to share with you and shoot this morning and we're doing one blog post so yeah. we shoot one blog post and then the rest instagram looks i meant to ask you yeah are you still shooting are you shooting on iphone anymore yeah because, because i find they've been looking so bright because I wasn't sure if you're doing them all on camera. This is the other thing we get asked a lot is how we edit our photos. So <laughs> we we're still working. On <laughs> we it. still it's a work in progress. So blog post always photos on always on camera, which the photographer brings. Sorry and that I keep going out of will... focus. I think it's actually sorry. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> They're going to come here. So she will edit those. So we'll send over our selects. Yeah. Um, so and... that's always on camera. And then what I've been doing camera. is like a mixture of iPhone and camera depending on the location and the lighting on the lighting also I find that photos that I'm like walking in like say crossing uh, yeah, the road so the camera they're much better on camera because of the speed yeah 
That makes sense. So also, just I want to know where the zebra crossing is because she has been doing loads of zebra crossing shots, and I said to her, we, can, we never do zebra crossing. Shots. You know where what? Is it's zebra so crossing? hard because the thing with um, crossing the road kind of picture is really hard. Takes, you take ten thousand shots to take and get for one. just one. So when you're just doing it on your own, yeah, you like yourself. Your legs are doing the right thing. Your face, your hair, your everything else. But when you've got two people, we we're actually always really good with that. You know, yeah. if one person looks the bomb, you just go with yeah. that picture. I mean, if one person got their eyes closed and their tongue yeah. out, we don't do it. <laughs> but we're usually really <coughs> sensitive yeah. to each other's feelings. And we always look at each other first in pictures. Yeah. You're like, oh, you look alright. But with walking ones, it's a lot harder. Yeah. We'll, look, we'll report back. So we're in Notting Hill. We've got a few kind of roads and stuff that we, we just shoot like it on. around here. It's nice and bright. And um, I think and quiet. We've learned as well because there's two of us in a picture. If you have a background that's really busy, yeah. it just there's too much going on. So we've always liked that kind of white, bright, clean aesthetic, yeah. and we feel like it works better when there's two of us. So we shoot for about two hours normally, one and a yeah. half. Yeah. Um, and then we go have some lunch, which we'll show we'll take you, you along, we'll take you along, ride. do some emails, have a bit of a catch up, brainstorming. So really, it's actually a lovely day. Ahead. It is a nice day. <laughs> when Seb picked me up this morning, it was like oh, it's like old it's, times. It like it just feels like the last four months has just know, gone it's so really quick. Weird. It's really weird. But no, it's really exciting to be back and we've got some cool looks we hope you'll love. Have we got a sale bit? What are we shooting today? I can't even think. Well, I think a lot of what we're shooting is probably in the sales. So anything, yeah. we'll, we'll flag that in, in, some really on good Instagram high and on stories so you can um, see all the discounts and everything. If you've ever messaged me, I'm at home, probably in my pyjamas. I'm in Selfridges. <laughs> you know, I've got these slides in. We wanted them last year. Too late in the game. No, they were sold out absolutely everywhere. And then we had a BNR bonnet and then we called like all the stores, couldn't find them. So she messaged me when she's in Selfridges saying, saying I'm in Chanel, they've got the slides, I'm buying them. Before I even had the chance to think, I'm like, okay, <laughs> size 39, thank you very much. So we'll share Beautiful. them with you. Also, I you really... take them on holiday? Yeah. I really... I haven't even tried them on. I'm going on holiday next week. She's going away in February. So that's, I'm going to be solo. So she's back. I'm back for one week and then I'm going to be Bye. Solo. Bye, <laughs> so sir. Solo. Over to you. But I have to remember how to smile in a photo. That was the one thing actually I found really Did weird. You find it at weird? the beginning. Well, you don't know what to do with yourself. I felt like my yeah. limbs were so long, like and my also, arms, and like I just didn't know what to do with myself. We're always like this in photos and like cuddling, and you can kind of laugh and joke. And also, if you don't really feel so great in an yeah. outfit, or if you're not feeling so great about yourself that day, you can kind of hide yourself with your friend, or just yeah. if you know. Yeah, it just and so it was weird. takes the it, You just feel off. really exposed yeah. when you're doing it on your own. Did you feel like you were kind of posing and doing things differently or did you feel like it was the same? Because I remember when you were on maternity leave, I felt I had to do things quite differently because it's very different when there's two people in a photo yeah. and then there's one because yeah. like you said, there's just more going on and like limbs and... Well, like for instance, we used to love to do the twin hashtag twin oh, set yeah. pose, which I couldn't really do on my own because it just looked a bit... It wasn't really a twin set pose. Well, yeah, exactly. One set pose. So yeah, I guess there were a few things that I um, had to adapt and... But I do remember that first shoot being like, what the hell? Like feeling so exposed and lonely and not oh. knowing what to do with my arms and how to pose. But then and, you, you yeah. do get into the swing of And it. also I think, just back to planning the outfit. So what we'll do is we'll think of a trend and then we'll try on the outfits and kind of match the other one. So I don't know if you find this, but sometimes I feel like if I'm not, if I don't quite know how to wear something, if you've sent me the outfits before, I'd be like, oh yeah, I can kind of yeah. fit in with yours. Yeah. So not only are you doing everything yourself just, creatively, you're like kind of, Selling all the outfits coming yourself, up with, yeah. coming out with everything. That That's kind of so takes true. the pressure off. Anyway, so we will um, sign out now, but the minute we get to the location, when we know what the location is, we'll log back on Show and the next part. see our outfits, and you can see kind of how we shoot and how it works. How basically. it all works. And yeah, this is our first shoot of 2019, back as a duo, and so hope you enjoy this. So, first look of the day, Phils, let me look at you. My scrummy, which is on sale at the moment, mango teddy bear coat. And what's the hat? I'm intrigued about the hat. So I ordered it on ASOS a while ago, and it was quite pricey. So I returned it. Right. And then last week, I was having a look online, and it's gone down to three pounds. That's amazing. Can I just also say that before 
I left on maternity leave. Philippa had never ordered anything from ASOS. Ne never. Because before I couldn't bear the whole like, returns. And now she's like really. ASOP obsessed. ASOS queen, yeah. And what are those jeans? I like them. These are my new Citizens of Humanity. I think they're called the Leah jeans. Really nice. And I'm just going to close up on our favourite necklaces. From Nell and Digby. Nell and Digby. And we've got the Mama. Good love. And my Mama one. Lola from Rose. Lola Rose. Should I've I got one on the way. Wearing? Teddy bear coat from Topshop, which is now on sale. New, is it Melly Miller? Melly Malou. Melly. That bag. <laughs> this is old cashmere, I think LK Bennett. Whistles jeans from the cell. New ones? Um, they were kind of like my first pair of jeans I bought like after having many. Not back in the other ones. The mum is yet. back. Then these boots which I bought from Amber Stories. Beautiful, sir. Should nice. we go shoot? Go Wait, shoot. can we say hi to Amber? Hi, Amber. Ah, this are. is our lovely photographer These and friend. Really long and lush. Really long. No. Really long. And she's lovely she's in every way. I've And she's bite sized. <laughs> she hasn't got her camera because um, we are actually going to take this photo on iPhone. On iPhone. So um, let's go. Let's do it. in the zone of like trying to get through everything we need to do we forgot to film our outfit for you but we thought at least we you would can see. you can see however we thought we'd show you all our goods in the back of the car we stack up the bags with all the stuff we're shooting and then we find different locations and now it's the car we try and stay as organized as possible because there's nothing worse when you're like trying to go through heaps and heaps of clothes and not knowing what you're wearing but we on a Wednesday or a Thursday, we style up our yeah. outfits. We've got all the photos on our phones. So when How we many have we sent photos have we sent each other, do you think? <sighs> we checked last time and it was like 6,000 or something. Yeah. Um, so we're on outfit number two. We've What's got, this you're wearing? This is Misha Lounge. We love Misha Lounge. Such a good one. And then you from have ASOS. From ASOS. ASOS. I bought this Aneem Bing t-shirt. Nice. Where did I, she get that? Do you know what? I ordered it from Shopbop maybe 10 days ago and I totally forgotten about it. It's like a late night purchase. And it came yesterday yeah, and I was like, oh, I really like this. I really, really want to, nice. I feel like we need to go to the store, by the way. I know. I think, should we vlog going to the store? Because I yes. think that would be quite fun. And, and we'd like to treat ourselves. Well, she won't be there, she's not here, but. <laughs> in, our, in our dreams. Um, and I love this. This is from Bershka, which I ordered when I got the hat on ASOS. I think, I, um, I think you need it in your life. Yeah, I'm really happy with it. It's a bit I like different. With, I like the fact that it's got the red through it. Yeah, and it's nice because it's a bit like a teddy bear shearling is style. It shearing? But oh, it's inside as well, nice. Yeah. It's nice and cosy. So Philip is warm and I'm freezing. <laughs> Fit number three. Why are you wearing so tall? Because I'm wearing the kitty girl. I know. I'll, I'll be like, get them like this. <laughs> trousers. Mm, I don't know. They're a bit. They're cute. No, they're real. Do you know what? I found these trousers in my wardrobe. They're from Zara. I don't even remember buying them. I've never worn them. But So this is for our blog post. From Monday's blog post. We've Back probably went live last Monday. Because oh, obviously yeah. this is for next Sunday. Um, High street back to work. High street on a budget. So many people ask me that question, right? Like what to, where what, to get? But the weirdest thing is because I don't work in the office now, I'm very, very rarely in like workwear staples. But it was quite nice getting it it's together. It's nice to feel but I would, tailoring. I would though. wear this with jeans, like with where this, is this, this, from this is from New Look. Ooh. I think it's on sale now, actually. So I would wear this for jeans, but I think you could wear it for your face. You could wear that with a cami or, or a like, t-shirt, yeah. whatever. So these are from Topshop, really like which are a really nice fit. And I've got it with my cashmere ASOS knit, which I love. And this, this is from is Mango, nice. which is a really good wrap kind of style, loose tailoring. And it's because it's long, because if you're wearing like a dress or something to work on, like white yeah. trousers, I hate it when it's too short. And also this coat looks really nice going over like a long knitted dress. Yeah. It's that good length. Um, so yeah, we're going to um, hit the road and start shooting. Pose. A one set pose. So but, for those um, that don't know, we always do a twin set pose, which is shoes and bags. So these are our so new... We love shoes and bags. These are Demelia. Demelia. Is that 
Um, Have you seen them? Yeah, we found, I actually saw these in Grazia months ago and they're finally really they really kindly sent us one. So we really love these, obviously. They S &P. come in really fun colours, but we went for black. Yeah, and just you can get so your wearable. initial on. And then I've got the Chloe Susanna oh, boots, which I have booties. worn to death. Um, they're quite a recent purchase, and you've got those ones. And didn't my um, Givenchy biker boots, which also I absolutely adore. They just help bring up like a really simple outfit yeah. like this together in a really wearable way. And chunky knits, chunky knits, and some nice shredded jeans, jeans. just for a laid-back kind of casual, easy look. Solo picture. I feel it's really weird, a being back and doing it without fills. But I thought I'd shoot a new coat. It's, it's quite oversized, but I, I really like it. I like this detail and the slit here. It's from Topshop Boutique, and I really like their coats. They're a bit more expensive, but I feel like this is a good one. Then I've got a sell piece actually, like Philippa's hat. This is from ASOS, and it's really oversized, kind of acne esque scarf. And then these boots, which I was lusting after, they're the same heel as our Bond heels, but in like a sock boot version. And they're actually really comfy. And some H&M jeans. Philippa got me into these after her, I was watching her YouTube videos with her shaping jeans. And then I've got the same little cashmere LK Bennett knit on. So this is my solo look, which we're gonna shoot now. Amber's just told me that I forgot to take the label off this coat. So excuse the label in those photos and taking it off now. So we've just done look number five. Finished first shoot. How first does it feel? Spud me. Spud you. It feels good. It was really good. Did you remember how to pose? I remember how to <laughs> pose. Although I just did one solo at the end, and that felt a bit weird. I was a bit like I wanted you as a cushion. Um, <laughs> it's just nice, isn't it, to feel like someone's energy next to you yeah. and to feel confident and bounce yeah. off of each other. But we did it. Five looks. Now it's time for some admin emails. And I'm starving. Lunch. So hungry. So we, we're gonna go get some munch. We always we we like to go to cow shed because it's a good working environment. And it's so chill. It's quiet. But we were gonna take you in, but we've realised no. we can't have cameras in there. So yeah. we're gonna sign off this vlog now. For anyone new, please like, subscribe, and, and thanks for watching. Thanks Hope for watching. you've enjoyed the vlog, and we'll see you next week. We're gonna be filming a high street haul, our yeah. five to six things that we found. We're not gonna. I've done some research, and so has Sarah and we're not going to share with each other what we found so that we can be quite surprised while quite we're shooting Quite honest and be like, oh, I'm not sure about yeah. that. So I've, I think I've got five or six things. Same. So um, we're so shooting that on Tuesday, which will go live next week after this video. So um, And this one's going away, so then there's going to be a bit of time with just me on the grid. Just for a week. Just for a week. So don't miss me too much. <laughs> Bye. Bye.